All right, we're doing the hook claws. We are gonna start. Actually, I don't know what I want to start. We can either start. Actually, I think I might go samurai because I want to do Margit uh, early, and then we can get the hook claws right away. Uh, let's go with stone sword key age. I'm gonna just pick a appearance here. This guy. One eye samurai. Are these claws in Stormvale? Yeah, they're in Stormvale. Right, good to go. So the whole reason for Samurai is really so I don't have to spend Smithing Stone ones on uh, a weapon before I get the Hook Claws, because we're going to get them right after Margit. And this thing has bleed, so I think it's just the best weapon to start with. We're also doing quality Hook Claws, so something to keep in mind, I guess. I don't know, it's really not that important. Just level strength and dex instead of dex. Pretty much the only difference. But I'll probably start with the normal route and we'll go get uh, Dectus, get the Source Seal and whatnot. I'm just not going to upgrade the weapon before Margit. Trying to remember how many claws there are in this game. I want to say four. Not sure, though. We've already done the Bloodhound Claws. But this is the second one. Both have been requests. Because honestly, claws, like the odds of claws showing up are not very great when there's only four of them. And we probably won't see them for like another hundred runs. Unless, again, we have another request for them. There should be a decent run, though, I would think. I mean, we have physical claws with bleed. You get them pretty early. I don't think it'll be too bad. Bleed is just so good to have in this game. Like, anytime I have a weapon with an 8 bleed or a bleed infusion, I just, like, breathe a sigh of relief. Especially when it comes to right card. Claw? Yes. Indeed. It's Tree Sentinel. Dude, can, can, stop. Give me the item, dude. Tree Sentinel's just like tearing down this church, dude. Brother, he's this guy's a menace. Tearing down buildings, killing animals. Take that off. We need to go get Quick Step too, because I need it for the infusion. It will sound horrid. Treat him. I wish that you could skip through NPC dialogue faster. Do that, do that, and then back to the first step. Dude, these groans are ridiculous. <laughs> it's so over the top. I love it. Grab this. Got a bunch of golden runes up in the cemetery. Ahead, and we can get. Uh... Actually, we have decks. All the decks we need. We only need fourteen. The requirements for this are pretty low. Eight strength, fourteen decks. And we have unsheathed. 
feel like I don't do too many samurai starts. I usually do hero. It just kind of works out that it's the most efficient class level wise, but it actually was for this to either hero or vagabond. But this has the Uchi, so I figured I'd take it. This is only like one level worse at the final build. Pick it up. Pick up. Thank you. Alright. Bunch of golden rune ones. Get Dectus. Buy some smithing stones. I'll probably get the uh, Axe Talisman too. I'm waiting for the day where I have to start two runs in like one stream of Elden Ring. Because it's going to just be like some crazy deja vu. Dude, how do you do this jump? There we go. Good old Dectus. We have not done a quality weapon yet. It's actually the first quality infusion, I should say. Not not a quality weapon, quality infusion. Affinity. I think we've done like all the other physical ones. We've done keen, we've done heavy. We've done standard, probably. But no quality yet, till now. Sell three of these, buy these, and leave. How much food do you think he can get for 600 runes? Also, where does he buy it? Is there a grocery store here somewhere that I don't know about? Bear's angry. I'm not here, bear. Can't prove anything. Open it. What other claws are in this game? Raptor talons? Bloodhound claws? I can't remember the last one. Venomous fang? Is that is that a fist weapon or a claw weapon? Might be a fist. Is there just like claw? I don't know if that's in this game. Poison ones? It is the- okay, I didn't know if it was or not. Because I think the Katar are fist weapons. They're kind of like claws, right? You know, like a pointed spike, or I guess a pointed spike is a bit redundant, right? Spikes are generally pointed. So yeah, in, in 42 weapons, we'll have done two pairs of claws, and then in the remaining like what 260 something we have two more claws so 
Unless they get requested, we probably won't see them for a while. We might get some more in DLC, though. I could see that happening. We'll probably get, like, one of everything, almost, in DLC. Every type of weapon. Even bows, which I don't want. Oh, God, if we get another ballista, I'm going to be so sad. Especially if it's, like, partially holy damage or something. Like the Erd Tree Ballista, ugh. Oh. I would cry. Answer seal. All right, what else do we want here? We want to get these smithing stones and the stone sword key. We'll get the sacred tear, maybe a golden seed in Celia, and then we'll head back to Limgrave, get some threes and upgrade. They barely give you, like, any 7s or 8 in the Dragon Barrow. And then you get, like, a Somber 8 and a Somber 9 so easily. It's so weird. Just in case. Oh, please don't pass threads. Grab this. I probably need to rest. I don't want to, though. Eh. No, not yet. Back to the first step. So we need six more... Yeah, six more smithing stone ones. And we'll go to, uh... Market. I need to remember to not upgrade this. Because I actually probably would have until I just said that. Any 
right, so one of these and one of these. Man, this guy is uh, not very friendly. America's got these people scared, man. That's plus three once we get the hook claws, and then we'll head to Lierni after that. Uh, actually, we'll probably we'll do Godric. We have to do Godric, right? We don't have to, but we will with plus three. For now, though, we have this. How many more flasks? Can I get like two? Oh, I can get three. Sick. And then I have two sacred tears, I think. Do that, that, and that. Should we get two blue? Yeah, let's go to blue. Because we have the physic heal. Uh, source seal. Hang on, let me rest. Just to refill that. So much damage. The plus zero. Duh. Still hit me. Oh, come on, stop hopping away, dude. Oh, the bleed got him. I was gonna do another in cheese, but that works. I think I will. Well, we will, but just for a bit. We're still going through the front, though. Let's see. Probably just get Vigor, honestly. 
We don't need any int faith or arcane at all. I probably am not gonna get too much mind. Do a little bit of strength and dex. Strength probably would be better just because if we're two handing, I think we get more. Although I don't know if it works that way on claw weapons because you don't actually two hand the weapon. You just put one in each hand, so I'm not sure how that works. Also, those were the souls I needed for uh, upgrading, so that is a rip, but that's okay. We can uh, pop this. Man, I haven't gone this way in such a long time. Oh my god, I hate these things. I can't even reach it. Luckily, these are really not that far in. Right there. Oh. Let me throw on this. I think, real quick, we're gonna run to Brunal, and then we'll go to the round table. I'm assuming Brunal has quick step. I don't actually know, but Bernal has like all the most basic ashes of war. Probably like 90% of the default ashes of war, I feel he has. He only has like seven, but there's so many that have like kick, parry, quick step, things like that. Endure, I think he has endure. Pop this real quick. Your name's Bernard. Let me ask. Are you here? Does your face despite all search? But there's nothing. Any intro? All I know now is that. All right. Let's see. Quick step. We don't need two of them because we don't need a second one of these. Well. See ya. All right. Now we can go to the round table. Plus three claws with bleed. And then I think we can maybe get uh, quality here. One, two, three. Let me see. Quick step. Standard and keen. Okay, so you need probably the, the one in Stormvale then. Maybe we should have kept going that way. Okay. Good to know. Let's go back here. That kind of makes sense though, right? I think for... Actually, does Quickstep always have Keen? Maybe that's what that is. There's no Bloodhound step. I don't think you get iframes on this, but that's okay. Not good. So let's go get a grace real quick, and then I gotta try and remember where to get this wet blade. Somewhere back here, you have to drop down to it, I think. Well, you don't have to drop down to it, but you can. Is it this way? It's 
behind a stone sword key door, but it's not that. I don't think it's this way. So dark in here, it's not this way. Unless... Maybe it is. Hmm. Here. Yes. Been a while since I've had to do this. I just don't remember... Is it this? Okay, good. And then... Unfortunately, I have 6,000 of these. I can't just walk out of here. Let me see if I can get the elevator here. We can grab the grace. And then we should be good. God, Stormvale's so cool. I just love the level design here. It's so good. All right, we should be able to do this now. Yep, quality, cool. All right, Ash of War on this. Quick step, quality. And then back to, I guess, here. We'll do Godric. I wonder if it's just faster to go this way. Probably not. Safer, though. I can't help but think of Odin from Ragnarok when I see this character. The eye patch and the balding head of hair. Like, the colors are completely different. He's not a green man with yellow hair and a red eye patch, but. You know, in black and white, they'd be pretty much the same. Minus the samurai armor. You get off frames on quick step? Actually, I don't know. Maybe you do. <laughs> that rock's not in the way at all. Ooh, and the bleed. Thanks for playing, Godric. And one day, Poor Godric. We'll return together to our home, bathed in rays of gold. <sighs> what is next? Ray of the Caria Crystal Tunnel, I believe. Should level up too. Actually, you know what? I think I'm gonna skip the tunnel. 
because we don't need the bell bearing. I don't need a second one of these. So we'll get probably plus seven and then we'll do Red Wolf and Renala. Oh, well, actually, hmm. Yeah, I think I think we can. I think we can do that. We'll see how many twos we have after we run through this place. All right, level up. 20. Strength, I think, is better. Let me see. 23. No, it's probably about the same. I think because, again, uh, we don't, we're not two-handing a weapon. We're just using two of them. So I think these are essentially equivalent the whole time. So what do we have for twos right now? Just one. There's a couple on this merchant. That's four. And then I don't remember how many we get at this run through. We might not have enough, honestly. Might need to do the tunnel. I don't want to do the tunnel. I don't have to. Unless I can find another spot with more twos. Grab these, and we're off into Lyrnia. There's probably like a gazebo or something with some twos around the ruins or, I don't know, somewhere. If we have four threes, then I can get plus seven, and that should be enough. There should be plenty for Red Wolf and Renala, and then we can just get the rest of the threes from the Bell Bearing and Eltis. Gazebo's out here. Hey, Nero. You had an MRI yesterday? Everything all right? Hello. Hello. Don't have time, Raya. Stop, I'm looking for a gazebo. Hmm, yeah, I don't know. Let's just go this way. I wanted to see if there's anything physically wrong with my brain to explain the memory and language problems I have. I'm assuming you're probably not going to get results back for a bit. Monday, yeah. Well, hopefully all is well with that. Maybe it would be better to just do the tunnel and not do any of this running. Hmm. We'll have to do some running, but different running. What weapon? Hook claws. 
quality hook claws. So we got all the twelves, or all the twos rather. We got twelve twos. There's a floating land octopus right there. I can't tell what it's on. A stump? Marag. No thanks. Only claw weapon I used was Cypher Pata. No range and holy damage I made playthrough very annoying. Yeah. I believe. I believe it. Oddly, though, I think it's a fist weapon. I think the claw, like, to, to be a claw weapon, it has to be, like, exclusively... Like, well, no. If the Venomous Fang's a claw, then never mind. But you would think, like, I... The Cypher Pata definitely looks more like a claw weapon than a fist weapon. Fist claw, same thing. I, it's close enough. It's just like the way, like with with all the weapons, like I differentiate them, but I also differentiate bows and light bows, so. Which are even more similar, I'd say. And chimes and talismans in DS3, because they're two different types of weapons. Claw has to be curved. Oh, really? Is that what it is? No tunnel, right? Yeah, we're gonna go to the Spirit Spring over here. And then we'll upgrade to plus seven, do Ray Lucaria. Then we'll head to Altus. Pokemon Ray Lucario. <laughs> Definition, a curved pointed horny nail on each digit of the foot in birds, lizards, and some mammals. All right, we'll go upgrade really quick. Back to the round table. I'm hoping we can avoid the snowfield in this run with bleed, but we'll see. Those alpha chat find a way. And strengthen seven. Back to Re Lucario. Hey Cabo. Good morning, man. How are you doing? Are we light rolling? Damn. He probably will be, though, by the end of the run. These are not very heavy. I'm doing well. Clawing my way through Elden Ring. As a definition for a claw, not a claw weapon. If we were to define fist weapons, I would say a weapon that covers the whole hand, in which the Cypher Pata does not. Yeah, I kind of agree with that. But I, I don't know how they, like, based their, uh... 
stuff, you know? I don't know why they determined that some things were claws versus other things not. Some are obvious, like the Seist is obviously not. But the Qatar, I don't actually, maybe that covers the hand. Oh, dude, come on. Not cool. Leap of faith. Maybe it's the way you swing it. Like, I feel like the the Cypher Pot is better as like a thrust weapon, whereas this is more like a slash. So for it to be a claw, it has to be more slashy than like thrusting or strikes. Like, yeah, you can thrust with this, but I don't really. Can you, does the Cypher Pot a slash? I don't know if it does. I still have two blue flasks because of the Uchi. Love that combo. That's a fun one. Try that again. That was pretty rough. Any bleeds? God, the true combos in this fight are just so brutal. Boss is so quick. I wish the arena was better. Like, this arena is so bad. So small. Alright, let's see. A little bit of vigor, too, I guess. Get this stone sword key. I probably get the golden seed. Why not? Get up there. And the thing is, like, zoom in at the bottom of the stairs. All right, Moongrim, behave. Too close. Get out of here. Didn't die, unfortunately, so it kind of sucks. Hopefully we don't die here. Once again, forgot to allocate my flasks. Is 
his bleed. Hopefully we can get a two cycle. Definitely can get a two cycle. Oh! That was very tight. I didn't think we'd get a one. Quick Cronella, hopefully. Hopefully he doesn't throw it somehow. Don't get hit, don't get hit. Easy fight. Lead carrying? Oh yeah, for sure. Alright, back to... here. No, here. Let me level up. Twenty-five! That should be good for the Tree Sentinel, and then we just do... either of these, really. It doesn't matter. And then we get runes. We can pop for the smoothing stones when we get the bell bearing. We'll get another 9k from the Onyx Lord, so that'll help a lot. So Seal Tunnel next. We'll get plus 4. Actually, we'll probably... or not plus 4. It'd be plus 12, but it actually will be like plus 13. Actually, maybe 14. And plus 14, I think, for the Tree Sentinel. I think the Tree Sentinel's pretty resistant to bleed, so... It will probably be a tougher fight. Also, he will very nearly one-shot me. Even with 30 Vigor, man, the Tree Sentinel just hurts. I don't think this lift is really a lift. I think it's just a teleporter. I don't think this actually moves. I wonder how it would work in seamless co-op, actually. Not sure how it would work. Can you beat Elden Ring with claws only? That's what's popping into my brain. To be fair, I didn't start with claws, though. Can you even get claws right away? I don't know that you can. Where's the Venomous Fang? Bloodhound claws, you can't. You have to kill a Bloodhound Knight. I was going to do a video like, can you beat something with something? 
I'd want to do like some stupid obscure thing like can you beat Elden Ring while wielding a different weapon for every boss, but every boss's every every weapon's like fifth letter has to be a different letter or something stupid. Just something so ridiculous, you know? So we have one five, we have zero fours. I can't believe I have more fives than fours. I don't even know where you get fours, honestly. Probably in Kalid, I imagine. Do this. Somehow I didn't do that before. 